uh, welcome back. Um, today I am off to Feltham to my training school, West London Motorbike Training I think it is, and uh, then I'm off to the Uxbridge Motorcycle Testing Centre to do my Mod 1 again. Um, previously in Mitcham I failed the last exercise, the avoidance hazard avoidance exercise by going five kilometres too slow. Make of that what you will. <laughs> but can't complain, everybody has to do it so um, yeah so hopefully fingers crossed please <laughs> um, no so what have I done what have I done to correct that uh, five weeks ago I bought this little baby the CB125F after I failed so I realised I need, did need to get some skills up get confidence up understand that 30 mile an hour is actually nothing to worry about unless you hit a lamppost uh, I just generally get you know, the feel of riding a motorbike. Because I was trying to do it training, test, training, test, pass, you know, and it doesn't work for me anyway. I have added, since buying this bike, 1400 miles, riding it to work in all weathers. Come, as some of you know on my website, I've got it on my YouTube channel, sorry. I've got uh, videos, I mean, early mornings coming home, up and down the A1, the bit that I can ride on, round the big roundabout of South Mims, you know, I've been doing near enough everything. And now, oh, I had another day's, another day's training uh, with the wonderful Brian. And at the end, we did about an hour on this avoidance test, both sides, left and right. And, you know, a few tips on what to do, what not to do. Don't hit the cones. Uh, oh, get in the right lane, Dave. Concentrate a minute. Okay, right. So, uh, yeah. So, get into the you know, the way to approach the um, the avoidance test. I remember it. I've gone over it in my mind. And all the other bits as well, so I've got to pass them and all. Got to do my observations every single time. So really, you know, it's just down to luck. But I'm going to keep going, even if I fail today. Um, you know, if I put a foot down or hit a cone or fail a particular exercise, I'm going to keep going. I'm just just going to keep doing it. I, you know, I, I will get it. Um, and the way I see it, that each time, I f you know, if I fail, then it's just another period of time that I'm out here on the roads, gaining uh, road mileage, you know, proper riding as it were, rather than in a, on a test pad. 50 shown, 50 given. And, um, yeah. Fingers crossed later on. Be celebrating, because she knows. It's a bugger with her crash helmet on, she knows. <laughs> so that's it, really. Um, I'm now pooling along, get myself to the training school. I uh, won't be able to show any of the uh, ride to training school and the actual training, no, sorry, the, the test. Sorry, I won't be able to show any anything the ride to Uxbridge Test Centre, that's it, and the test. Um, and probably not a lot afterwards, actually, because I'll be using an intercom of, of the schools providing, and I just don't want to mess up anything with the Bluetooth on and all this sort of nonsense. So uh, it'll all be switched off, the camera's off, and uh, I'm just going to focus on getting there safely and doing the uh, test safely. 
hopefully pass it. No, I will pass. Not hopefully, I will. <laughs> Famous last words. Um, so, there you go. Short little intro to this thing. And hopefully a little bit later, in a few more hours, when the sun's out a little bit better, I'll have some good news for you. If not, then I'll be redoing it again. <laughs>